I want to talk about this search though, or at least the ordinance shit. Like I don't usually go over search, but honestly, the the ordinance stuff to me creates some really cool like meta changes to search. But I understand why people wouldn't like it in terms of cheesiness. Like you can just get naded off spawn, but it would start to create a meta, right? Like it would start to be like, okay, if they are gonna throw this fucking car nade, all right, we can't get to coop early or we have to go around this way or what happens if they start just nading this car you know or like okay we're just gonna have to give up like initial b control so now maybe we just keep going a more often or something or now we just hit mid through and let them stay towards b like there's a lot of things that could start happening simply because teams might start to hit ordinance nades and then what happens if there's a, a whole thing where it's like oh we know new york likes to throw this this nade over here so we're gonna wait the nades what if they wait out their ordinance nades and just nade you while you're trying to go this way now like after you know you've tried to wait for this car nade, they actually just don't throw the guard nade and now they just throw one for the entrance you know there, there's a lot of things that you can start to think about and i think that's fun i think that's cool to like try and figure things out but i understand that it's it's like really cheesy just because it's like you know, the start of the round just get fucked. But then it's like, okay, you don't want to initial coup patrol? Or you're gonna you're gonna nade us from getting coup patrol? We're just gonna try and like send a meta where we just, you know, keep pulling out A or keep pulling out mid to A or or do other things. Maybe throw ordinance nades ourselves. Bro, in this round we get killed by an ordinance aid right here. They go around to this lot and throw an ordinance nade. The funny thing is like we knew about it. We tested it out, bro. Damon, Damon was constantly hitting this car nade. So we knew it was a possibility, but I guess like we just didn't expect that they were going to pull that shit out. But we knew it was a possibility for you to ordinance nade off spawn to hit this car because Damon would keep hitting it on us. Like I was, I was one of the, like the test dummies. Cause I was like, all right, let's see, let's see if we can fucking like, let's see how deep we can hit this ordinance nade. And Damon was automatic. He would just constantly hit that shit. It was actually really funny. Like the other guys, they would, they would, they would hit like the, maybe the entrance over here or maybe like one out of like three times they would hit the car, but Damon was automatic with that shit. So we knew it was a possibility. We were just like, I, I, we just didn't expect that they would do that shit in the match, but typical to them, like they fucking hit it. It's not, it's not that easy to hit. But it creates a meta where it's like, oh, fuck, we can't go B or have initial control towards, uh, like, coop side anymore. And there you go. Or we can throw an ordinance in ourselves. Literally, they throw the ordinance aid from lot here. What we were trying to do was we would, we would try and do an ordinance aid where you would, you would be able to hit, like, the white truck over here, but you wouldn't really get the timing. But they did, like, their research. They, they wrapped around lot here, then threw it, and you can throw it over here. That's how we die to this. So now it's like, okay, if you want to ordinate Sane on defense, okay, we can ordinate Sane on offense and we can do the same shit to you. So that's why I kind of was like, oh, it is kind of bullshit that it got GA'd, but maybe that's just me because, I mean, I'm not the one playing, but I like the idea of like more mind game shit to ha that, that can complicate things. Now, I personally, I would, I would ban... The crazy wall bang uh plant spots over the, the ordinance nade stuff i would ban that shit first or ga that shit first before the ordinance shit gets ga but maybe that's just me or does nade at least you got to find the lineup test it out do it in a match like actually you know hit it the fucking the g8 spot or the the wall bang spots anyone could do bro i could do that shit easily Anyone could literally, anyone could just wallbang a spot if they know the spot, but like doing the nade and doing it with the timing and like actually hitting it in a match is a little bit different. Obviously, like both of them should probably get taken out if you're taking them out. But if I were to take like one to get taken out, I would, I would take the, the, the wallbang spots first. I just think, I just think it creates a cool like mini game inside search. I was at the event and my heart sat, sank when they got the triple nade. Mine did too, because I was like, fuck, we knew that was a thing. But they just hit it. Like, I don't know, we probably should have expected it, because they were doing the ordinance nature shit the whole time. That they could do it. They get punishing, or they get punished for figuring shit out. That's what I'm saying, like, they did the work, 
but then they just it just instantly got taken away from him because everyone was just like, oh, it's cheese. But like we were, I mean, we were testing shit out. We we were doing ordinance saves ourselves this tournament. I would have just liked to see what it would develop into. But I, I understand why it's cheesy, because you're just getting naded off spawn. But again, like, start doing something different, you know? I don't know. I feel like that's the common shit. At least back in the day, it would just be like, oh, well, we can't do this anymore. They're throwing the strong arm shit. First, let's do it ourselves. And then second, how can we fuck it up for them that they're using their nays and shit like this? Like how? Oh, whoa! There's there's significant advantages we have it on other sides of the map, or with with them not having tax anymore or shit. I, I don't know. I would just like 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 to see what it would turn into, but we didn't get a chance like that. Oh, any teams? Maybe you meant any teams? Do you think you can make a difference? Uh, I don't know. I think it's gonna stay the top four teams. Maybe that's just me, but I don't think anything's really gonna change. That was the. That was the ordinance aid. So, like I was saying before, it to me it was just annoying because we knew it was a possibility. Fucking Damon, Damon was hitting this automatic, this car. Other other guys, I think I think Ant was trying it. Ken may have been trying it too, but it was it wasn't automatic. It was like once every once every three or four they would get it. So they weren't like as confident to, to use it in a match. But typical for Skies to, to hit that shit. Why didn't Ornance get banned? It was nerdy and cool to see this. I mean, I was talking a little bit before, but I I would have liked to see how everything would have developed. Like, there was a lot of things that... that a lot of things that can be, like, like start developing because of Ordnance Nade specifically. Like, I was talking about, you know, you have the card nade now. If you think they're going to hit the card nade, you're obviously going to either delay your push or you're going to go this way around or you're going to go A. Like, obviously, you know, the fast coop control just isn't going to be a thing anymore for the offensive side. You could also just throw the nade yourself. We died round one to them hitting nades over here on the offensive side. Ordnance nades aren't just defensively sided nades. You can do it on both sides. You just have to be creative with it. This one is just a, more annoying because it's a common route, especially if you're going towards the B side and it blows up the car. So you just have to hit one of them. Like you don't have to hit two nades on it. You just have to blow up the car. Is that a cool dynamic though? I think it is, but I see the cheesiness of it. I personally, maybe, maybe it's just whoever you ask the preferences, but I think it would be a cool thing to start seeing how it develops. But I, I, I see the cheesiness in it. Why not just ban on this map? Because I don't know, they just don't want to have to deal with it on the other maps, I guess. Because there's, uh, there's other stuff on other maps you can do ordinance need-wise. 